Gorgeous. <laughs> what are you doing down here when you could be in bed with a legend in lovemaking? <laughs> That'd be me. I couldn't sleep all night until an hour ago. Oh, you should have woken me up. No, that's not fair. It is, I wouldn't have minded. Oh. All right, I tried to wake you. You bastard. <laughs> Oh. Sitting on you, screaming at you, inserting a pencil into you. <laughs> you sleep like a great big fat old elephant seal. <laughs> Cheers. Well, you're all ready for work. And so nicely made up. I was bored. I'd painted the fridge. You painted the fridge? Well, it made sense at three o'clock this morning and I finished my jigsaw puzzle. Oh, I'm sorry, love. You should have made the monkeys all different colours. It was a nightmare. <laughs> Say ah. Oh. Yeah, and again. <laughs> Come on, we better get you off. Mm. Do I look okay? Yeah, love. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just do you. Oh, Hello? come here, mate. <laughs> come on. Yeah. I've always been such a good sleeper. <laughs> do you remember when I fell asleep while we were making love? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Don't worry. I don't remember it affecting my enjoyment. <laughs> oh. It's quite a night, I can tell you. I picked up this prostitute at King's Cross. 80% <laughs> leg. No visible means of support. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> And she's looking at me quizzically, and I'm thinking, hey, up, someone fancies the cabbie. <laughs> you got bacon in your hair. I'll get it later. <laughs> so I asked her if she wanted to pay the fare in kind, you know. And she looks at me and says, I'm going to Notting Hill, not Aberdeen. <laughs> <laughs> so we laughed about that. Well, mainly her, uh, to be fair. But by this time, I'm pretty pumped up. So, I've got out a mucky vid, cracked open a six-pack, and then another one, just to be sure, and then, I think, another one. Anyway, at some point, I must have got hungry, cos I woke up with me face in a cake. <laughs> what is wrong with you people? Who? You and Carrie. She left the house this morning looking as though she'd been set upon by birds, and now you're all... Will you please take that bacon out your hair? <laughs> What's the matter with you? You always used to like a drink and a bit of dirty talk. I know. I've grown up. I'm in a new place. You've moved? <laughs> no. I've developed into a mature human being. You've got mushroom in your ear. Mushroom? I ain't having mushroom. <laughs> Must have been from last, last night. night. Fantastic. <laughs> It was driven mad by insomnia. Hmm. No, really mad. Clinically insane. Oh, bless you. <laughs> yeah, she tried everything to get to sleep. Sleep classes. Vodka with cocoa chasers. <laughs> Moving to Luxembourg. <laughs> have you tried sex? Of course I have. What am I, 15? <laughs> to get to sleep. Oh, no. You are out of it. No, I'm fine. OK, finally time to go home. Well, no, it's only ten past eleven and you've got a client waiting. Okay. Facial? Bikini line. Good, thank you. <laughs> Good 
morning. Hello. Is that a bikini wax you're wanting, or are you just pleased to see me? Now, <laughs> 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 oh. I will be applying a warm wax with a spatula, then gently just hell. What are you keeping down there? A Scotty dog. What? <laughs> Sorry. Ignore me, I slept badly. Oh, I actually enjoy removing hair. Mm, it's like mowing the lawn, isn't it? <laughs> Bet you don't have to go out into the garden. My husband, Barry, wants me to have a Brazilian, you know, a baldy job down there. And I said to him, it's bad enough you coming home with a five o'clock shadow without me having one too. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, you do start to obsess about body hair in this job. I got to read this big manual from a beauty exams and it's got the most amazing pictures of things that can go wrong. You know, ingrown eyebrows, exploding follicles, <laughs> hair growing on tongues. <laughs> Okay, let's tame this gorilla, shall we? pardon. Two minutes too late. And isn't it ironic? <laughs> Me just to get to sleep. Yes. Not very nice, is it? I'm not human Valium, you know. I've got me pride. No, you don't. No, not normally, no, but you've painted the friggin' TV. Oh, come on, Barry. I've had eight cups of chamomile tea, or was it grass? It's hard to tell. I've watched two hours of baseball. Help me, please. Okay. Chat to me. Anything. OK. Well, I don't know what to say now. <laughs> no, I do. I do. OK, um, if you could be an insect, which would it be? That's no good. I'll I'd be a, a wasp. <laughs> I've decided I need new friends. I reckon Kirk's dragging me down. You've only just noticed. <laughs> I'm going to go next door and ask Jean-Francois, you know, if he'll hang out with me. Jean-Francois, the tenant? Yeah. The French doctor? Yeah. Sophisticated French doctor Jean-Francois, who is so obviously an intellectual? Yes. <laughs> Sweetheart, he's way out of your league. He isn't! He is not! I've got different levels. I'm like a... Multi-storey car park. Your back's getting really hairy. No, it isn't. Well, hey, don't be embarrassed. 
Honest hair is wonderful and natural. And I can have that removed in seconds. Oh, no. <laughs> no, 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 get off! I just want you to look nice. <laughs> Here, I'll look at this. <clears throat> Before and after. Before, hairy, uh. After, smooth, gorgeous. <laughs> You're a vile little body fascist, aren't you? You're always going on to me about getting a Brazilian. Yeah, that's different. That... Oh, that is unpleasant. <laughs> what are they? Moles. Oh. That's more like it. Illustrated guide to bikini waxes. <laughs> What fish would you be? <laughs> I was meaning to telephone you, Barry, because the dishwasher is being strange. Is it? Mm. Don't use it for a couple of months. See if that helps. <laughs> anyway, in fact, I'm here with a different hat on. Un <laughs> chapeau différent. <laughs> ah, un chapeau différent. What? You know, I'm not wearing my landlord's hat. I am wearing the hat of a friend. Un chapeau de un amigo. Ah, bah oui, avec ce temps anglais complètement pourri, il nous faut bien un tas de chapeaux, même emprunter à des amis. <laughs> <laughs> what? Let's start again. Mm. I want to be your friend. Oh, okay. That would be... Uh, why? Because you are an intelligent man. <laughs> Thank you. And my current friend, Kirk, is... How can I put this nicely? Uh, the silly one. <laughs> the silly one. Exactly. He is silly. <laughs> I am not. No? No. I... Well... I like watching films with the writing underneath, you see? <laughs> yes, they're great. Good! So, what do you want to do? Where do you want to go? A uh, museum? No, let's not do that. <laughs> Have you experienced a British pub yet? Not really. I'm not uh, a big fan of, you know, uh, lad culture. Nor me. I hate all that. <laughs> but maybe we could start at a pub, then go to a museum. A late night museum. Okay. <laughs> Good. Tomorrow night. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, Barry, the Hoover is also making a sad noise. <laughs> oh. See you tomorrow night. <laughs> Yeah, pretty quiet night, actually. Two junkies tried to steal me big lucky rabbit's foot. <laughs> and this drunk kept shouting, I'm gonna be sick. But I pulled him out just in time. And he did it all over me sandals. <laughs> Drive safely. You sure you don't want me to leave St Christopher in? He's very good. <laughs> I'm all right, cheers. Actually, Kirk, I've got some bad news. Do you want me to sit down? No, it's not that bad. Great. <laughs> yeah, sit down. <laughs> How long have we been friends, Kirk? Many years. Yeah. And I'm thinking it's time we took our friendship to the next stage. Fantastic. Which is... Not being friends. <laughs> not being friends? Yeah. What would we be, then? Acquaintances. Back to acquaintances? Yeah. Isn't that a step backwards? Yeah. Oh. I think we need to start seeing other people. <laughs> oh. OK. We'll still be sharing the cab, so we'll see each other around. Yeah. We can catch a movie now and again. Yeah, sure. You've got other friends. Yeah. There's that bloke who serves you down at the post office. Yeah. 
and your gran. <laughs> you can really get to know her. Discover the real gran. Yeah. Thanks. Oh, you dropped your lucky testicles. <laughs> now you can chuck them. They ain't been lucky. See if the swelling goes down. Reassure client and don't charge for treatment. Call an ambulance immediately, bollocks. <laughs> Now, Barry, trust me on this one. any hair there, so you know who's in the wrong here. You <laughs> You skinned me alive! God, I must have done that when I was asleep. Oh, don't come the innocent beautician with me, you freak! I was at a loose end! I can't sleep! Well, take tranquilizers like everybody else! Where, where are you going? Somewhere where you can't molest me. <laughs> No, you go. Go on. Go. Do your favourite breakfast. Not hungry, thank you. It's, it's crispy bacon. That's your favourite breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> I am really sorry. Do you forgive me? Yes. <laughs> We've got to crack this insomnia, love, before you strike again. Are you worried about something? I don't think so. So, you're not worried about having nothing to show for your life, nothing like that? <laughs> no. Or your hair going white and frizzy and mad, like your mum's? No, look, shut up, will you? See, I, I know what it is. It's, it's this manual. What now? Yeah. Look at that. A whole page of middle-aged breasts. Well, that is a worrying page. You're scaring yourself. I'm hot. Oh. Look, do you think I'll end up like one of these? What kind of sick 
book has a whole page of substandard arses in it. <laughs> I am going to confiscate this book, and I predict that from now on you will sleep like a baby. OK. Think of something lovely before you go to bed. OK. I know. Read this in bed tonight. It's got some great news on this fantastic new cab they're developing. Thank you. Oh, and I'm going to be out tonight? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm going for a drink with Jean-François. Uh-huh. I'm a bit nervous, actually. <laughs> you don't think this looks like I'm trying too hard, dear? <laughs> Harry? <laughs> Et voila! Oh, Jean-Francois, this is my daughter, Sinead. Oh, pleased to meet you. She has the classic English physiognomy. What's it to you? OK, Jean-Francois, let me introduce you to the subtle joys of English bitter. Oh, yes, the famous warm, weak beverage drunk by chubby men. <laughs> That's the one. Uh, two pints of best, please. Sinead. Straight glass or mug? Which one best enhances the qualities of the beer? Are you taking the... Straight glasses, please, Sinead. Thank you. She uh, suffers from the textbook lack of confidence so often associated with a parent split up. Oh, yes. Was a divorce messy? Oh, yeah. I, um... I think that psychologically at the time it felt like we were at the bottom of a hole. And it turned out to be a tunnel. <laughs> and she got the car, which really pissed me off. <laughs> well, you know, Gara's penis. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Although, to be fair, she did use it mainly to get to the shops. <laughs> Cheers. Usual place tonight. Pint of bitter. <laughs> Where is the cigarette machine? Mm. By the door. So you got a new friend? Yep. You don't hang around, do you? <laughs> what? Is he more sophisticated than me? Is he? Is that it? Is it? Is he more sophisticated than me? Would that be it? More of a sophisticated, is it? Yes, he's more sophisticated than you, yes. Can he do this? <laughs> yes, he can. Oh, he can, can he? Yes, he can. Oh, he can, can he? Jean-Francois, this is Kirk. Oh, pleased to meet you. <laughs> right, I'll be off then. It has almost the quality of licorice with an aftertaste of vanilla. Yeah. Oh, yeah! Bloody hell! Twenty virgins came down from Inverness. <laughs> when the ball was over, there was four and twenty legs. Come on, you've had enough. Mm. OK. Had enough! Oh. Oh. Je veux te faire des bébés, Chinette. <laughs> Allez, viens. Couche-toi là! Get off. Mm. Stop being all French. And let me suck you. Oi, 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 that's enough. Jean-François, get down! More beer! I can handle it! No, you can't. Come on, Jean-François. I can't. I can't. I can't. Oh, my God. <laughs> right, that's it. You can find your own way home. Hey, 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 don't leave me, mate. Oh, right, all right, all right! Get him out! Come on! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Je t'aime, Harry. Yeah, yeah, shut up. <laughs> and now, on to the museum! <laughs> I can't sleep, Carrie. <laughs> Your manual's scaring me. <laughs> I can't destroy it. I mean, it's power. <gasps> Go on, have a Brazilian wax. <laughs>
<laughs> this isn't going to work, is it? I know. doing this for our relationship, Carrie. <laughs> so don't be cross. <laughs> I've cooked your favourite breakfast. Have you shaved it? <laughs> I'm sorry, but you started it. I think I missed a bit. Yes, you did. Would you like me to tidy it up a bit? <laughs> no. Are you feeling sexy? <laughs> no. Hi. Um, come in. Um, no, I, I won't stay. There are the keys to the cab. And, uh, I brought you right back. <laughs> um, do you want to, you know, catch a movie sometime? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Tonight? All right, yeah. Will you be bringing him? No. No. Cool. Did it not work out then? <laughs> really? No. That's enough. That's enough. <laughs> <laughs> 